Greg Vondell, Superintendent of School Sauk Rapids Rice. Um, today I was wearing a little bit of a different hat because I was the MC for the Citizen of the Year Awards Program. This year's uh, winner was Phil Peterson. Uh, it was a real pleasure for me to do that because Phil retired from here about a dozen years ago. Uh, but uh, he didn't leave education. He certainly didn't leave service to kids and community. Um, he was given uh, this award because of all of his work with the Benton County uh, 4-H program, with the Benton County Fair program, with just church community, civic community. His, his, he started an Urban 4-H club. That was just a marvelous thing that uh, that he has done. Uh, Phil is very deserving and, and joins a long list of, of uh, people who have had a significant impact on the Sauk Rapids community. My name is Phil Peterson. I'm the 2008 recipient of the uh, Sauk Rapids Citizens of the Year Award. Uh, Sauk Rapids is, you know, a fairly small community, but it's close to bigger bigger stuff, but I guess what I really like about it is the people and the kids makes it all worthwhile. The people who comprise the Sauk Rapids Citizen of the Year Committee, some of some of these members are, are past recipients. Uh, some of them are just individuals who are very, very active in community in other ways. Um, each year our committee begins to get together in January and over February and March we put applications throughout the community and send notices to service clubs and really look for the kind of people that have had significant impact on our community. Um, People who are Sauk Rapids Citizens of the Year don't necessarily have to live within the city of Sauk Rapids, but their work has to impact the Sauk Rapids uh, broader community. Whereas Phil Peterson taught industrial technology and coached athletics for 39 years and continues to be active volunteering for numerous organizations, and whereas Phil continues to work with youth, opens his farm to strangers, and tends to his other <coughs> friends, I didn't see that in the proclamation. Okay. You're being honored because of your work with our feathered friends, Phil. That's good. And whereas Phil has hosted Christmas Eve services in his barn for the past 14 years with an attendance last year of over 900, and whereas Phil will receive a commemorative plaque at the ceremony held in his honor on Thursday, April 24, 2008, now, therefore, be it resolved by the Committee on Rules and Legislative Administration of the House of Representatives of the State of Minnesota that it congratulates Phil Peterson on being named 2008 Sock Rapids Citizen of the Year and thanks him for his service to the community dated April 18, 2008, signed by Margaret Anderson Kelleher, who is the House of Representatives Speaker of the House, uh, Tony Sertich is the Chair of the Rules and Legislative Committee, and Dan Severson, State Representative. So we have a House resolution on your behalf. Well, it's, uh, it feels good, and especially what really made it feel good was the phone calls and, and congratulation cards that I've gotten from former students and former 4-H kids, and I guess that's what makes it all great. It's, uh, yeah, there's been many things, but basically I think it's watching kids from the time they're, they joined 4-H, or even when I get to know them before that, and watching them grow through the years, uh, not only in 4-H, but uh, in in school at church, and just seeing them from one the stage to the other. I thought, you know, they, you see the older. Wonderful. The morning I was informed of this award. Wayne Grandy had called to say he would like to stop by to discuss some fair board issues. When he arrived, Terry Sylvester, Terry Sylvester was with him, and Terry has nothing to do with the fair board. <laughs> What is this about? I silently questioned. Then they told me why they had come. And Terry had the audacity to ask me to shave and change for my best farm clothes before she would take my picture. I read the list of past winners and knowing many of them and their accomplishments, I really felt honored to be listed among them. I'm Phil Peterson and I'm very honored and humbled to receive this award of Citizen of the Year.